Hey, what's up guys? This is Crafty Fox, and right behind me are some Minecraft Pepsi trucks. So I have three different designs I'm going to be showing you how to build today. So here we have uh, the Pepsi semi-trailer truck, and this one is uh, one of the newer modern designs. It has like this nice um, light uh, blue texture to it. And then right over here we have like uh, the old school Pepsi truck trailer truck uh, with the big letters like this. And then we have like the standard um, smaller Pepsi truck design that's not a semi-trailer truck. And yeah, here's what it looks like. So I'm going to be showing you how to build all three of these today. So let's get started on the first one right over here. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to take a stone brick slab. And then we're going to have that hover above the ground like this. I'm going to make it two blocks long. And then we're going to place another brick slab. And then another stone brick slab like so. Right behind it on the sides, we're going to add gray wool. These are going to be our front wheels. Then we're going to place a quartz slab right behind it. And then another brick slab right behind that. And then we're going to add um, in the front quartz stairs. You want to have it so it faces outwards. And then another one right behind it that faces towards the front. So it's kind of curved. And I hope you can see this uh, with the shaders on. It's kind of bright. Then we're going to add in the front grill, which is bedrock. So let's add two bedrocks wide, like that. On top, we're going to add quartz slab, two blocks wide. And behind that, we're going to add quartz stairs, uh, two blocks wide as well. And I'm trying to land on there. All right. And then we're going to take a quartz block, which I hope this is a quartz block. Yeah. And then we're going to have a C shape on this layer here. It's going to be four blocks wide. And then on the side, let's add a quartz stairs facing towards the back. And then quartz blocks in the middle of that. And then we're going to add nether brick stairs upside down to the sides, like this. And then we're going to add a dark oak wooden button to the side, along with a lever. It's dark oak wood button, lever. Dark oak wooden lever, and then we're going to place uh, another brick fence on top of the lever. You can crouch down when you're placing it so you don't activate the lever. Then we're going to add in the windshield, which is just um, black stained glass panes in the C shape. In the front, we're also going to add in a uh, weather skull and skull for um, the mirrors on the hood that you want to angle them a little bit and in the front let's also add in a license plate which is just a standard sign like that all right then we're going to go uh, to the back of this let's add um, lapis azuli and we're going to make uh, three blocks long like this and then we're going to go to the bottom and we're going to add it so this part is 13 blocks long so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen then once we reach the back we're going to add two by two lapis lazuli on top like that and then we're going to do the same thing on the other side it's pretty much symmetrical then we're going to add in uh, the Pepsi logo, so that's going to be uh, red concrete, two blocks long on the top layer, and that right underneath there's going to be two quartz slabs like that. Then we're going to take out um, quartz stairs, going to have two upside down ones like that, and then a right side one up on top. This is going to be the P. And then next we're going to add a quartz slab underneath that stairs. And then quartz slab there, and then skip a block, or well, half a slab, and then add another one down below. And then we're going to make another P, which is just like two upside down quartz stairs. Then right side up, quartz stairs, quartz slab right underneath. Actually, yeah, that part. And then we're going to add in a quartz stairs on the top part, and a quartz slab down below. Then we're going to have quartz stairs upside down in front of there, which is hard to place. And skip a slab, add quartz slab on top. 
And then the next row is just two quartz blocks like that. So we got that nice Pepsi. Now we're pretty much going to be doing the same thing on the other side. So let's do that. Um, they're going to be lined up in the same area. So where this ends, we're going to start the other side. So just red concrete like that. Quartz slabs underneath. I'm going to make that P using upside down. And then right side upstairs, slab underneath there. And then the E is just like a slab here. Skip a slab, another slab down, and then we're going to make another P. Yet again, which is a bit tricky. I need to place some blocks temporarily so I can place it right. Like that, add a slab underneath that P. And then the next one is going to be uh, court stairs facing the other direction. Like that. Court slab down here and then what else is there? This is going to be upside down quartz on the bottom layer. I think my speed is turned up. That's why I'm having uh, problems. All right, then we're going to add a quartz slab on top here. And the last one, two quartz blocks like that. So we have basically your uh, Pepsi logo. Now, to make it look a lot better, um, we're going to actually fill it in. But before we do that, we need to add in the quartz slab. So go right to uh, where this red is in the back. And we're going to add a gray wool down underneath it right there. Same thing on the other side. This is going to be the back wheel. Now let's add stone buttons to the sides of all our wheels while we're at it. Okay, and in the back we're going to add four blocks wide of quartz blocks. All right, then we're going to add, um, make a border of quartz slabs around uh, the truck. Let me check if the other side's like that. Okay, so this part's probably a mistake. Like that, and then we're just gonna make a border all around the Pepsi truck with uh, quartz slabs, and you can even fill in the floor if you want to. But since you don't really see the floor, I don't, I don't think you have to do that because you can't see underneath the truck unless somehow it's rolled over in an accident. Um, but now we're gonna add um, lapis lazuli. Let's add it in between in this hole here. And we're going to also add it on the inside part of the Pepsi logo. Just cover up that area so that we have like this nice 3D effect. Do the other side, same thing. Like that. So now you can see the Pepsi logo a lot better. All right. So now we'd go to the back again. And we need to add in this part. So that's going to be two light blue concretes on this side. Red concrete here, and then a quartz slab there, and lapis lazuli right behind that area. On top, we're gonna add two lapis lazuli in the middle, and quartz blocks on the sides. Now, to add further detail, we're gonna add a row of dark oak wood fence gates, and we're gonna open that all up. And then on the sides, we're gonna add some buttons. So acacia on top, and birch on the bottom. And in the middle, we're going to add one birch wind button on that side. All right, so let's go back to the front and let's add in quartz block. Um, right over here, we're going to fill in this wall area. Make it look at two by two by three like that. And then we're going to add quartz blocks to the sides. And this middle area, we're going to add some quartz stairs uh, facing the same side like that. And we're going to add red concrete behind one and lapis lazuli around the other one. So we got that nice. Actually, the second one is a quartz slab. So made a little mistake there, but not a big deal. So we got that nice Pepsi logo in the front. Now, um, for the rest of it, we're going to add uh, lapis lazuli in the middle. Just go all the way across. And the sides, we're going to add quartz slabs all the way across and this is so that we have that nice border uh, that goes around in Pepsi trucks <clears throat> there's a little bit of red showing on this side but it's not that big of a deal it's kind of like hidden by a shadow 
All right, so here's what it looks like so far. Let me just check. Oh yeah, we also need to add in the roof area. So for the roof area, um, let's add uh, gray concrete. We need to fill in this floor. So add gray concrete here, two blocks wide, and then we're gonna take string. And let's make it two by two, I guess, right over here. And then we're gonna add a row of white carpet across like that, four blocks wide like that. And on top of the actual roof itself, we're gonna take uh, white carpet, just go across, <clears throat> and pretty much go all the way to the back. All right, so once you finish adding the carpet to the rest of the roof, that's pretty much it on how to build a standard Pepsi truck. Now I'm gonna show you how to build the semi-trailer one. So we have two different rigs over here, and they're actually quite similar although they are different designs. So I'm gonna be showing you how to build this one. And if you want to make the other version where it has the smaller letter writing, I'm gonna show you how to modify this truck to look like that truck. Maybe you want both of them or something. <laughs> so to get started on the Pepsi truck, uh, let's go over here and let's add in uh, the wheels in the front. So add gray wool like that. Skip two blocks in the middle and add another gray wool. In the front, we're gonna add four blocks wide of stone slab hovering above the ground. And then to the left-hand side of the middle, we're gonna add a sign right there for the license plate. Then on top, we're gonna to add two blocks wide, bedrock. And the sides, we're gonna add two court stairs. And the second one's gonna be curved around like that. And then on top of the hood, uh, we're gonna add in court slab two blocks wide and behind that uh, two court stairs. All right, then behind that, we're gonna add um, basically like an zero shape using quartz. So it makes like a little O, it's four blocks wide like that. And then we have like a nice hole in the middle. Then the back, we're gonna add two pillars of quartz like that. And the inside part of that, we wanna add um, two black stained glass blocks like that. Then we're gonna add a border of uh, black stain glass panes around uh, the front part of the O shape. Then the side here, let's add in quartz stairs facing the back and two quartz blocks in the middle. And then we're gonna add quartz stairs to them upside down facing outwards. And let's add quartz blocks inside there. And also this area, let's add quartz block in there. So then we're gonna add in um, a quartz slab right behind the front first wheel and then two uh, another brick slabs behind that. Same thing on the other side. Then we're gonna add in the middle, add another brick slab so that they connect. I'm gonna make a two by three of another brick slabs. Then the back here, let's add in a gray wool like this, for the back wheel. And then we're gonna add stone buttons to the sides of all our wheels. And then the front, we're gonna add in wither skull and skulls for the side view mirrors, or I don't know what to call it, the front mirrors. The side view mirrors over there. Uh, so let's add that. It's gonna be a lever and a acacia wooden button. So lever, acacia wooden button. Same thing over here. And then we're also gonna add another brick fence on top of that lever. All right. Then on the roof area, we need to add in string inside. Just make a two by two. And then we're gonna add a two by four of white carpet on top for the roof of this trailer or just cab like so. And then we're also gonna add some exhaust um, right over here on this side, it's a little asymmetrical. So we're gonna add three blocks tall of cobblestone wall and then two blocks tall of birch fence like that. All right, so in the back of this trailer um, cab, we're gonna add in uh, those wires that always appear on the back of caps. So we're gonna add in uh, another brick fence here and acacia fence on the other one. <clears throat> and yeah, I think that's it for the cab. Now I'm gonna show you 
how to build the trailer. So for the trailer itself, also it is optional if you want to have like having standing down like that. By the way, you can add those stands. So let's add in um, this part that connects to the trailer. It's going to be two blocks of gray wool. Why am I saying gray wool? Gray concrete like that. Then we're going to add in um, four blocks wide in front of that of stone slab. Like so. And then we're going to add in a wall here of quartz. So it's going to be, I would say, a 2 by 4 of quartz down here. And then we want that little logo showing up. So there's going to be quartz stairs in the middle, quartz slab on the side of that. And then we need to add in, I think, red. Yeah, there's going to be a red concrete behind the stairs. Lap zilla around right behind that slab. Then we're going to add quartz around it and also on top. So I got that nice wall. Now we're going to add in um, this lap zilla right behind it. So let's make it so it is going to be, um, let's make it 19 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. And then I made it a little too far, so delete 2. So in reality, it's going to be 17 blocks for that. Let's do the other side, same thing. And then um, in the back, we're going to add smooth uh, stone. We're going to make it 4 blocks long. Same thing on the other side. And then we're going to add a acacia wooded slab underneath. In the middle, we're going to have two facing each other stone brick stairs. And then underneath that, it's going to be a row of iron trap doors across like this. Then we're going to add a 2x2 two two of lapzuli on the bottom and two lapzuli on top. And then in this hole here, we're going to add red concrete here and a quartz stairs upside down like that and a lapis lazuli on the inside of that stairs. All right. So now let's add in, um, I guess, the bottom part. So we're going to add in three more um, stone slabs here. So one, two, three. And then an upside down stone brick stairs. Same thing on the other side. Like this. And then we're going to add a stone slab all the way across to the back. Same thing over here. And then, um, yeah, let's add in the wheels over here. So skip a block of space um, away from that iron trap door and add a gray wool like that. Then we're going to skip a block and add another gray wool like that. And same thing on the other side. In between, we're going to add um, two by three of nether brick slabs like, like that. And then we're going to add stone buttons to sides of all our wheels. And right above it, we're going to add in um, two by three of gray concrete. Now the rest of the trailer, we're going to add in stone slabs all the way across the floor. Like so. Alright, now we're going to add in that little canister down below. Um, so that's going to be skip three blocks away from that back wheel. So one, two, three, and then there's going to be two stone slabs on the inside part like that all right so now um, let's add in the Pepsi logo so the Pepsi logo uh, we also so first we're going to take a three by three of lapazuli and add it on this side then we need to go to the other side and add a three by three of lapazuli on the other side that and then we're going to add um, lapsuli all the way across the bottom and let's do the same thing on the other side pretty much all right 
So once we are left with this, um, let's go on this side, uh, we're going to add red concrete, two blocks long like that, and then laps, I mean, why am I saying that? Quartz slabs underneath it. I'm going to make it a P2 upside down, quartz stairs, and then right side up, quartz stairs, slab underneath it. And then um, for this one, there's apparently um, quartz blocks. Uh, two blocks tall like that. Then quartz slab here, skip block or skip slab, quartz slab. And then we're going to make another P using two upside down, quartz stairs. Right side up, quartz stairs, quartz slab. And then actually this part, yeah, we're going to have it a uh, quartz stairs facing um, towards the front like that. Quartz slab underneath it. And then on the bottom, there's going to be a uh, quartz block right over here, like that. Skip a slab and add a quartz slab on top and then two blocks tall <clears throat> of quartz. Now we're left with this and let's add in lapzuli cross all the way like that. So you got that logo covered up. Now let's add lapzuli all across the roof area. Like so. And then we we're to take um, acacia wooden button and add two to the back on top of the trailer like that. All right, then we're gonna add in um, light gray wool uh, carpet across the entire roof of the trailer. All right, so once you're finished with that, you're pretty much done. All you have to do is copy the logo on the other side. Just flip this thing around so it looks like this. All right, so now I'm gonna be showing you how to build the third type of design. So remember, we're just gonna be modifying this one to look like this one. So let's go back over here uh, to this cab area and we're gonna delete all of these um, carpet on the roof. Then we're gonna add in uh, a row of quartz blocks on the back, four blocks cross. In the middle, we're going to add two quartz blocks like that. In the front, we're going to add a quartz slab, two blocks wide like that. And in front of that, there's going to be uh, two quartz stairs, so like that in the middle. In the side, we're going to add a quartz slab here. And then the quartz stairs right behind it. Same thing on the other side. Then in the middle here, we're going to have a hole, so we're going to fill that in with um, quartz. Like that. So we got that nice, I don't know what to call this, but it helps with the aerodynamics. Um, it's like a little fin. So now let's work on the trailer if you want this new modern design. Uh, let's go back over here. And basically, the letters itself are actually smaller as well. So what we're going to do is take uh, this thing here and we're going to delete this. Delete these three blocks here. Add quartz block here. Quartz stairs here. Lapizuli back in there. And then we're going to delete two blocks on top, two blocks on the bottom, two blocks on the side, and another block over here. Then we're going to take out a uh, light blue concrete and add it in the following places on top, on the side, and on the bottom. And the rest, we're going to take out a uh, light blue wool and then we're going to fill in the rest of the holes like that. All right, so the logo itself, let's um, delete these two blocks here. And then we're going to take quartz stairs upside down, have it here, and a quartz slab right there. And then this part here, delete this and delete this as well. Might as well like delete a lot of this stuff um, in the bottom row. So we're left with this. And then we're going to go to this side. Let's add two upside down quartz stairs here, right side up quartz stairs. And then upside down quartz stairs. Then we're going to add a row across of quartz slabs and delete that one in the back. Put that quartz slab like that 
So it's like a nice line like that. All right, so if you have any holes over here, I'm not sure. I think there's no holes here. Good. So let's fill in that uh, light gray wool on top of the carpet. And yeah, also if you want to make it optional, you can add in these stands of um, stone brick uh, walls over here. They're new in 1.14. You can add this, and you would do the same thing for the logo on the other side, of course. And yeah, that's pretty much it on how to build the Pepsi truck. And also, apparently for the back of this one, I used um, birch one by instead of stone, but it is optional. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it on how to build the Pepsi truck in Minecraft. Three different designs you can pick, whichever one you want to, or you can have all three and have it in your distribution centers, or maybe you're making the city and you need it to look cool. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, remember to hit that like button down below and subscribe if you haven't already because I'll be uploading more videos like this in the future. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.